quality meats, savory salads, fresh produce, and some delicious desserts. All things you can find at the Standard Market in Westmont. Marcus, check it out for us. Yeah, it seems like uh, grocery stores are starting to head in this direction with yeah. a lot of fresh produce. Mm -hmm. We went to the Mariano's in Arlington Heights when that yeah. opened. Now, those place. are all over the place. The one right here, it's always busy. So, uh, wanted to check this one out today. It was pretty impressed. Take a look. It's a differentiated market concept than other grocery stores. We wanted to make more of a really a old market feel, kind of a tour of European markets under one roof. Brett Verkeich and his three partners had been working in the produce supply business for decades. About five years ago, they started brainstorming ideas for their own store, and Standard Market was born. The basic premise fresh. All your fresh departments, the perimeter departments of a typical grocery store, in one location, and we wanted to own the best of those departments. Virtually everything under the big white barn is perishable. There are 250 employees at the market, and large glass panels allow customers to watch them work. We wanted to incorporate a, a little bit of theater in here so that we got credit for all the work that we were actually doing in the store. Because yeah. we are we're chopping up our own vegetables, we're preparing all of our own ingredients, we're sending it to different parts of the store. So all the different departments play together. There's a lot of transferring that takes place in the store. All of the baked goods and pastries are made fresh in-house. And if it's meat you're looking for... We've got a lot of different uh, local companies that we use here. All of our beef comes from Aurora Angus. You know, they're located in North Aurora, just 30 miles from here. Something else that we do that most other stores don't do is we have a dry-aged beef case. So we're actually dry-aging beef for 28 days or more. So we'll do ribeyes, we'll do strips, and we'll do top sirloin. The store also sports a large selection of wine and cheese. And if you're a craft beer lover, just remember, breathe when you walk into the liquor section. I think you have enough beer. We do have a good variety of beer. Matter of <laughs> fact, uh, we have one of the most extensive collections of Midwest craft brews of any store in the area. You can plan your meals for the week with easy-to-grab ingredient bags. And if you're hungry now, the standard grill restaurant sits right in the center of the store. Here we have our steakhouse burger. This burger is, it's an amazing burger. It's, a, the burger is a blend of chuck, sirloin, and brisket. So it already starts off with a really good patty. Then we top it with Dunbarton Blue aged three-year uh, cheese. We put a little bit of blue cheese uh, on there. We put the uh, fried onions on there and then top, uh, added sweet potato fries on the side. Sweet potato fries are so fresh, those were sweet potatoes this morning. We cut them fresh every day. So far, customers have been steady. They'll be launching another restaurant right across the street this May. As for how large this concept can grow... We have plans to uh, expand, and we want to expand throughout Chicagoland. This is our home. This is where we're from. This is where we, where we want to play. You can try it for yourself. Standard Market, 333 East Ogden in Westmont. Number there on your screen. Now, on March 24th, they're going to have their big... Uh, open house. They're not calling it grand opening because they technically opened last November. Okay. It's going to be a chili cook-off, cooking demos, all kinds of fun stuff you can do there. And if you were asking about prices on things, yeah. they tell me they try to come in under Whole Foods and compete with Jewel and Dominic's. So obviously if some of the fresher, rare items you're going to pay a little bit more probably, sure. but they try to be competitive. So okay. Eye popping stuff though. I mean, Yeah, I know. You walk in and it's like, wow, the design's really yeah. neat. So hopefully it uh, works out for those guys. Sounds good.